talk about the specifics of the case. The chief minister said, if a boy and girl are in love, it is not my job to stop that. What kind of a response was this? And if the chief minister says things like this, then what impact does it have on the investigating agencies? It puts a cloud over it. And people are watching. It's a trivialization. Uh, uh, no. It's a it's a it's an abject. No. Allow me to complete. Uh, allow allow me to complete. It is a it is an abject trivialization, a brazen trivialization by the state machinery. And I think it is a gang rape. Even one where the allegation is yet to be probed cannot be trivialized, especially not by those who are meant to be guardians of law and order. I should not have to say these things. These are fundamentals. The mother has said. The mother has said, Riju. Her daughter bled for de to death. Her daughter was bleeding profusely. The mother who has lost her daughter, who was gang raped and was killed after that, she's saying we are sure she was gang raped by the accused and his friends. And who is the accused? The son of a Trinamool Congress leader. The son of a Trinamool Congress leader is the person who is accused here. The family face faces threats, continuous threats. And I think they are very brave to go and file an FIR with the police and talk about it. Very much so. Right? Now, today you are in power. Hmm? Today the law and order machinery is with you. And today you can say that the problem is with the media. Right? The problem is with the media. You can say what is happening in other states and things like that. But you are in power in Bengal. Hmm? The son of a Trinamool Congress leader has been arrested so, uh, after the matter after after the matter has been carried out in the media and look at the words of the Calcutta High Court. Calcutta High Court is very clear. It has said that in order to have a fair investigation in the matter, the investigation has to be carried out by the CBI, which is which is really, you know, uh, which is really uh, should cause you more concern because then the court is convinced that you cannot have a fair investigation. If, uh, unless the CBI looks into it because the Trinamool Congress leader's son is involved. Hmm? And that the whole matter, Riju, is being discussed not in Bengal, across the entire country today. So I think I don't know why there was an attempt at brushing it off. Uh, yes, can I speak now? Hmm. Thank you. Uh, first of all, I just want to say that, you know, give me the courtesy of time and I will not interrupt in Mr. Ms. Verma's quote. So, I, I, it's a very sensitive topic. As the official spokesperson of Trinamool Congress, I just want to say this, that, you know, we completely condemn this heinous crime and we have zero tolerance for any atrocities committed against women in Bengal, number one point. Number two, there are sequence of events that millions of listeners of Republic should know. On 4th of April, this uh, incident happened. 5th, the girl child passed away. Then her body was cremated by her family, which her father How did she gave pass away? How did, to how the did she pass yes, away? The how did she pass the away? No, one minute. How did she pass away? Can I you, you, no, 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 no. Of heard, course, you I can finish. But no, of course, you, I have not so put out a narrative. Everything that I've said is very much in the court document. I don't put out narratives. My question to you is, however, in the choice it of words, when you have said, uh, was she gang raped? Was she gang raped? Was she gang raped? Is it difficult for you to admit? One second. Was One she second. gang raped? Uh, was she gang no, raped? No, no, it is not about. Was she? No, no. Was she? Was she gang raped? It is entirely about that. Was she gang raped? Is her family saying she was? The, uh, the, is, her fa the, is her mother saying she people, was? Is her father saying she the was? The family... No, no, you, you are questioning the family of the victim now. The family said... The family... No, no, I am what not at all. Not at all. Please don't put words in my mouth. The family filed a complaint after the cremation of the body after five days. And based on the family statements, the West Bengal police have arrested the accused. They have put POSCO Act. They have put IPC 376, which is gang rape, and they have put IPC 302, which is murder. And both the primary accused are behind bars. 
the chief minister of the state is also the home minister of the state who have given her statement based on the input she has received as the police uh, as the home minister of the state and she has said that this is an inquiry ongoing all That's these files have been charged and the case is in the court the father of the girl has said in a written document to the police that we have cremated our daughter nobody snatched her body number one the mother in a written statement in a very written statement has given her zaban bandi to the court which is not available to the media or to the public or to anybody for that matter so i don't know how this media trial is happening which is adding insult to this injury and all the politics that is happening on the media because of this which was not a political incident to begin with uh, the opposition parties who are irrelevant in bengal are continuing with their courtroom and vulture politics which is adding grief on the family nothing else nothing else may i the bengal police did their job as simple as that and whatever may whatever I? the court has said about the investigation of the F cbi we i am not going to comment i am going to take the court's decision and we are going to cooperate we want exemplary punishment for the accused and no one should be spared but please do not do not make every heinous crime political just to float your boat in bengal that is the lowest of low politics may that I? is my message to the Or opposition no. parties she's responding to you i have much to say but she's